He viewed this as not a testimony to him, but to all people that were in this situation, leaders in this situation. He was a, a person that, that just made you feel secure being around him. Just the way he walked, his bearing, the way he talked, that's the way he was. You have to remember he was a young, young first lieutenant when he came over here leading these guys and it was really his first experience with combat. And he, was an, he was an average guy, actually, but he rose to the occasion and he met it and he helped us meet it too. The man really is, I think, represents the quintessential leader. I mean, he, uh, humble, intelligent, decisive, unflappable. I mean, there's so many, so many adjectives can be employed to, to describe the man. I don't think he had an enemy. I think even the Germans must have liked him. But he was a, he was a great leader and everything he did was right. He always, always, all his decisions were right. He made very few bad, bad mistakes. Right, I don't think he ever made a mistake. The guys really reverenced him because, not worship, reverenced him. Because he had a, a, an innate sense of doing the right thing. You have to have the confidence in the person that's leading. You have to trust the person that's leading. You have to feel that that person's interested in your own welfare. And these, uh, these were all exemplified by Dick Winters, I think. And, to, uh, and he, uh, he had our respect. This memorial is interesting because Richard Winters being, you know, the incredible humble man that he was, didn't want a memorial to himself. He, he, he wanted a memorial that was really representative of all junior officers that were involved in op Operation Overlord, and, and there were some great ones, but at the end of the day, it's, it's tough to make a statue of them all. So if you had to pick one guy, no question in my mind that that Richard was the guy to pick. Ladies and gentlemen, the Richard D. Winters Leadership Monument recognizing all those who led the way on d -Net. When I look at that statue, that monument to Dick Winters, I see it uh, portraying the American soldier. The, the determination when he's in a, a situation that requires him to stand taller than he really is, and that he thinks he is, and to overcome. And as Dick Winters uh, stated, to hang himself. The circuit is incredibly proud to be a part of the Richard Winters Leadership Memorial. I think it's so important to not only remember the lessons of heroism, honor, and sacrifice learned for World War II, but to pass those lessons on to future generations. Mm -hmm.